Hi, I'm David Rothery. I'm Professor of Planetary Geosciences here at the Open University. I was a volcanologist for a long time. Now I'm doing research on the planet Mercury because it's a European Space Agency mission going there soon and we have results of a NASA mission, so that's a great field of research. Uh, in terms of teaching, I've been teaching geology courses for a long time and I also run the Level 2 Planetary Science course. And uh, then when we had a chance to do a MOOC about moons, I was very pleased to be asked to be the lead academic on that. It's an exciting topic to work on. It means it's challenging because you can't just produce the MOOC and let it run time after time. There are always ways to, to refresh it. My planetary science course still has books. Now, the, this new book edition came out about four years ago, but we have a, an online forum and we post news items and the students themselves go on the internet. So a course is more than just a book. The book can be a very handy thing to refer to. People like it, they can keep it forever, they can annotate it and so on. Um, a lot of the more recent courses are moving more and more online. That's received a mixed reception. You can refresh an online course very easily if the system doesn't get in the way. It's very important that it's not too bureaucratic. I can add something on my course forum very, very easily at the moment. So I'm, I'm happy with that. It's a matter of finding the right balance between traditional materials and, uh, and keeping it online in a way that you can update it. Um, MOOCs, we were able to make last minute changes all the way up to the first week of presentation. Then when it got running, things were happening. A new moon of Jupiter was seen forming within it, a new moon of Saturn rather, was seen forming within its ring system. And I remember writing a paragraph about that. It was a news item, it was relevant. We put it in the course.